Okay, I'm going to do a, a nice little uh, sand hill pattern. Catch fish wherever you go. Um, you can even use this in fresh water. Trout will take it in smaller sizes. Caught smallmouth bass with this as well. It's a really easy fly to tie. And what we do is start for a 1-0 hook. Hook size you can do. Depends on your species you're going for. Um, lay down a thread base. Then a little bit of varnish on top of there. Make sure it's a good varnish as well. Because your material is going to stick to that. Take a piece of chenille, around 5 inches, and just tie that in there, like so. The varnish will make its way into that and stick it. Okay, we then wrap around, and we're going to form a, a ball. You'll see why in a second. Let me tie that down. Okay, nice little ball there. Now we're going to put bucktail on there, so a little tiny bit of varnish on there. Again, just to make it stick and we'll take some bucktail this is um orvis i like orvis bucktail prime northern um just tends to be really nice pieces on it okay so we grab a little section about that and clip it as close to the base as you can okay and then just trim it straight. Okay. Now what we're going to do is just tie that in on the front. Build up a nice head. Can't beat a good bit of head. Yep, not too nice. At this point, if you want to put flash in, you could put a piece of flash in there and then put another small piece of bucktail over the top of that. I don't with this particular one because the orange gives it all the strike point that it needs. And we'll whip that off. Okay, and again I add a, a little bit of flame to that just to any loose bits of bucktail out there. Okay. And touch of varnish on there. With the thread you can use any colour you want. I mean I've kept it kind of a green just to give it a little bit of darkness on the front offsetting that sharpness colour and that is it simple as that now that will catch you pretty much anything really